Naisna is still very much a big part of the wood and timber industry. And it's from here that majestic artworks such as Genesis were born. For many years, its home was the Naisna waterfront. The sculpture was carved out of the root stump of a cypress tree by artist Theodorus Duplessis. Theo started carving. He stood back literally with his chainsaw. He drew one or two chalk lines on, on the stump and he started carving and these figures started emerging. I didn't, at first I was horrified. I thought, oh dear, what have I let myself in for? You know? But you know, as it, these figures emerged and it became obvious that he knew what he was about. Um, and the end result was absolutely incredible. Genesis has already been replaced with a sculpture called the elephant. The elephant, which is also carved from a cypress tree, is very symbolic of the Naisna forests and the town's timber heritage. I can say yes, but uh, we love that Genesis. Everyone loved that the Genesis. So we wanna, yeah, we also like this one, but the Genesis, I like it more than this one. Mm, we prefer that Genesis. The one that was here before, um, people seem to be amazed by it and lots of people were walking past here and they couldn't believe their eyes. Um, each time a person would like walk past, they would stand and they would like gaze for a second and then they would stand in front of it and take their pictures. Genesis has been sold at an undisclosed amount. It will be sent to Cape Town first and then shipped to the USA. Segwichetti, SABC News, Neisner.